capturing the voice of emotions. That's what Svetlana Alexeyevich says she's most focused on as a writer. The 72-year-old is perhaps Belarus's most famous author. Thanks above all to the raw strength of her collages of oral histories. And thanks as well to a nod five years ago from Stockholm, when she was awarded the Nobel Prize. Svetlana Alexeyevich, for her polyphonic writings, a monument to suffering and courage. Born in Ukraine and raised in Belarus, the power of her books lies in what she calls human voices that speak for themselves. Be it in the stories of female Soviet soldiers in World War II, in the unwomanly face of war, or in the heart-wrenching testimonies of voices from Chernobyl. Interviews that read like a haunting novel and tell of the very true horrors of the nuclear explosion. Her books, intrinsically political in nature, were long kept from being published in Belarus. And she's been a staunch critic of Alexander Lukashenko and of Moscow. The situation in Russia and Belarus is still going to last a long time. Before, in the 1990s, we had the naive hope that democracy would come. But for freedom, you need free people. Following this August post-election crackdown, Zaleksevich joined an over 30-member council to try and bring about a peaceful transition, which now has her in the sights of police. Condemning brutality against protesters, she said the president and authorities have declared war on the Belarus people.